What's going on YouTube? Jeans here. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day today. We are back playing some Pokemon Sword and Shield and ladies and gentlemen, we got ourselves a phenomenal video coming at you guys. We got ourselves a Trick Room Orbital team alongside with Life Orb Pseudo Wudo. So if you guys are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smash that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. Thank you guys so much for the support that has been going out on this channel. But shout out to my boy Hayden for dropping this team. It looks amazing. Something totally off meta and I cannot wait to hop onto that right ladder with it but rocking out in our first spot we got serena over here with triple axle play rough power whip and high jump quick with the queenly majesty ability and that assault vest to make this pokemon a little bit more bulky but we also got indeedy for this trick room team cannot have a trick room team without indeedy we got the follow me on it the helping hand hyper voice and expanding force also the psychic seeds to give it a defensive boost in the psychic surge behind my face cam the one and only pseudo wudo never used this pokemon before on the rank ladder so this one's gonna be hype he's gonna be tons of fun to use i have Absolutely love his uh like how he looks and all that and I cannot wait to show him off. He's got rockhead ability, so no recoil damage. Life board for that 1.3 times multiplier, sucker punch for first turn priority, hammer arm for coverage, head smash for our stab move, and wood hammer for another coverage move. I always thought he was rock and grass. I didn't realize he was just rock, but learn something new every single day. We got Orb Beetle right next to him. He's our trick room Pokemon and he has light clay. You guys know how I love that reflect and light screen Pokemon. So he has the Reflect, Light Screen, Ally Switch, Pest it Around, and Trick Room. So this Pokemon is doing no damage. He's just there to set up Trick Room, Ally Switch, and set up some screens. Bottom left corner, we got Gorgeist right here with Grass and Ghost typing. Frisk has his ability, Grassy Seeds. So once we get that terrain rolling, we can actually pop off those and get rolling with that. Then we got Trick Room with this Pokemon. We got Power Whip for Stab, Poltergeist for Stab, and Shadow Sneak, Shadow Sneak for Stab and First Turn Priority. Bottom right corner, we got final Pokemon. We got Muzzdale with Stamina over here. Leftovers, this thing is an absolute beast. If you keep uh, keep it in there and have Stamina get rolling, this thing can potentially never die. It'll just bulk up and just start eating up shots. This thing has all coverage moves besides one, which is a stab move. We got High Horsepower for stab, and then Super Power, Rock Slide, and Iron Head. Guys, if you want to try out the team for yourself, you guys already know the deal. Run the code is at the bottom of the screen, but let's get after it. Let's hop on that rank double ladder and try to get some wins with this Life Orb Pseudo Wudo team. First battle coming at you guys, this guy has a decently meta team with Tapu Fini, Urshifu, Rillaboom, Reggie Draco, Raichu, and Incineroar. I feel like the big problem on this team is going to be that Rillaboom coming after my Pseudo Wudo and my, uh, what's it called? And my Mudzel, who I really want to bring. I gotta bring Trick Room though. I gotta bring Trick Room. He will probably fake me out here. I'm gonna go in DD or be able to try to set up Trick Room. Roll from there. Uh, he has Incineroar as well. I want to bring Pseudo Wudo with that rock typing. This thing is an absolute beast. Hits really, really hard. I kind of want to go Mudsdale, but at the same time, I feel like Gorgeis might take the cake here. I feel like we have to go Gorgeis with those grassy seeds, and if he brings Rillaboom, we can prop, pop them up and get rolling with that. Because say I bring Mudsdale and he just Dynamaxes that, uh, that Rillaboom, he can roll out, kill my Pseudo Wudo, kill my Mudsdale, and just be an absolute beast from there. So I am going to go Gorgeis here. Well, guys, does cover that uh, top of Finny as well, which is really, really nice. Let's roll with it. Let's roll with it. Let's get it. Let's get after it. I do like Mudsdale, though. I really do like Mudsdale. But hopefully, we can set up the Trick Room, roll out from there, and get buzzing. But yeah, Hayden, when Hayden sent in this team, I looked at it. I was like, yo, this team looking nice. A little off meta. Let's see what we can do with it. And it has Pseudo Wudo. I never used them before on the Rank Ladder. But that's what I love about Pokemon. It's like every single Pokemon can be usable if you just like build it right. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. But I love it. Let's go. It goes Incineroar and Urshifu, which is uh, totally fine by me. It's totally fine. I'm just going to hit a nice little follow me. Can't fake out. Because my indie doobly My indie doobly My indie -dee. See the berry on that thing? I'm getting my surge popping. Oh. Right. I feel like when you have Frisk, it should just like have like a little icon of what item they have over top of the Pokemon for the rest of the game. You know what I'm saying? Instead of just telling us real quick, because sometimes I just don't see it. Intimidate's going to pop here. It that don't bother me one bit. That don't bother me one bit. Not one bit. Trick room. It's coming out. We're doing it. We're going to trick room here. And then I am going to just follow me here. And I want to set up my screens as well. That would be, be dandy candy. Get some screens rolling here. And what are you going to do? Incineroar. That's my real question. That is my real question. What are you actually going to do? Make a move. I would love to get out my pseudo widow and just hit that thing with like a like a rock head. Boop, see you later. Just drop that thing. This guy's thinking he might swap. He might swap here. He does have Urshi here. 
Urshi, Urshi's kind of scary. Um, he's gonna come out here. As long as I get off the Trick Room, we should be thriving. I, I don't mind if Indeedee goes up, goes down. See what he goes for. He goes for the Wicked Blood. That's totally fine with me. You gotta hit me up there, partner. Nope. Let me just go down in one shot, which is totally fine. If I can eat up that shot, we should be thriving. Like I said, all I need is my Trick Room up. If I get my Trick Room up, I can get out my boys and we can bust from there. He's gonna go for a Snarl. Yo, oh, I love that. Love that you went for a Snarl. I love that. I, I have no attacking moves. The Trick Room is up and rolling. Alright, so Trick Room's up and rolling. Now, the real question is Do I get out Gore Guys? Or do I get out my boy Pseudo? I think I get out Pseudo. I don't Dynamax. I Rockhead over onto that instant reward slot and potentially Ally Switcher. I really do want an Ally Switcher. But at the same time, I am going to set up a Reflect. And I am just going to head smash over onto you. I am just going to head smash into this thing. This thing should okay it. Just say, see you later. But I'm not gonna Dynamax him. I'm not, I think Gorgas is gonna be my Dynamax Pokemon. Urshfu is actually scary. Who? Let's see what happens. He's gonna withdraw. Oh, I love that turn. Thank you very much. And who are you gonna get out from there? Rillaboom. That's huge. That's fine. He doesn't know I have Ally Switch either. We're popping a Reflect. I can Ally Switch next turn. I really, really like. And he's gonna get those, that grassy terrain out there for my boy, uh, for Gorgas. Oh, look at this. Bill, get out my face, yo. Pseudo Wudo coming in big. All right. We like that turn. I really do like that turn. Now I ally switch. We get the reflect up. That's a huge. That's a huge reflect. We pop him. Surprised he didn't rock out with like a close combat. He probably might be choice. He probably is choice. I had to guess. He has to be choice, right? That's why he probably swapped. He's got to be choice bandit. He just wicked blowed into me. That's fine. Um, Robooms probably gonna try to just throw a grassy guy. Try to take me out. I am gonna hit an ally switch here. And I'm gonna hit that thing with another head smash or rock head, whatever it's called. Vinny is popping as well. That's a little scary. That is definitely scary. Missy Surge is popping. I do, like I said, I have Gorgas in the back. I have Gorgas in the back. Oh, no more grassy terrain. I mean, that kind of helps me out a little bit. But yeah, definitely hit this. Definitely head smash. I could would have. But I am just gonna rock into a head smash over on this Rillaboom. Rillaboom's posing a big threat. Did I see the real boom hitting harder than the spinny? Spinny might actually calm mine. This one's gonna be close. Again, we still have our Gore Guys. Who I really, really like. Gore Guys. Because he is ghost typing. He's dandy. Which is nice and dandy candy. Make a move, my dude. Make a move! He's gonna fake out. Oh, you gotta fake out, my dude. Ally Switch doesn't come out before that. Kind of a waste of a turn then. Considering this thing's probably just muddy watering. Do it a flinches. Oh, ew. that one hurt. That one hurt. <laughs> that one really hurt. Okay, I think we gotta go after Finny now. I'm gonna head smash over on the Finny. And I don't think I'm gonna. I am gonna actually out switch again. I'm gonna throw him a curveball. I actually probably maybe should have set up a light screen that turn. But I am gonna go for the ally switch. Try to see if I can get full him up again. He doesn't know where I'm going. He doesn't know where I'm going. I'm ally switching the game. I'm ally switching the game. You don't want. It. You're not reading that. Not a chance. Head smash coming out here. Do some work on this thing. Built some big damage. Just some big damage on a finny. On a finny? That's some big damage. You're gonna go for a muddy water. That's fair. Pseudo Budo, can you eat? Can you eat this pseudo? You don't. Oh, you buttery biscuit, man. E. E. You buttery biscuit. Knockoff's coming out here. Yeah, yo, that's my light clay. And I'm dead. And I'm dead. All right. Comes down to my boy. The one and only. The one and only. The one and only is coming out. Gore guys. Can we clutch it up? I know, I know it's a, I knew it was going to be tough to get some wins with this team. It's so off meta. But I feel like I feel like we should be able to pull out a win with this team. Let's get it rolling. So Pseudo Wudo did dump on this one, which is pretty cool. We're just like, yeah, get out of my face. We buzz out from there. We are going to frisk up. See the soul vest and... And the leftovers, I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna to try to take off Finny here. And get my grass train popping again. We still do have a reflect up, which is lovely. Still do have a nice little reflect. And should be on here for a little bit. And Gorgas is pretty bulky. And then we have the grassy seeds that are gonna crop. And is this thing gonna protect? I maybe should have read the protect. I probably should have read the protect. Let's see what he does. We still have Trick Room, so uh, I should have first turn priority for this turn and maybe the next turn. This one might be the last one, actually. 
That might be the last one. Let's get it. Let's go. I wish uh, what's called was actually part of. Uh, like I said, I thought he was actually part of grass type too. Pseudo Widow, that would have been huge if he was part of grass type. That would just. That would be awesome. That would, that would cover a lot, you know. But it, he is gonna Dynamax. Is that the Finny? Is that the Finny? Is he gonna guard with the Finny? Or is he gonna go. Well then. He is gonna go with the Finny. Show me he's not guarding. If he doesn't guard, we could potentially just KO this thing. That'd be a huge turn. No guard, no guard, no guard. Bro, what you mean? This dude guards us. Smart play. I'm gonna have to go after it again. He wasted one of my turns. That would've been a big reason. He's gonna knock off my seeds? You... Mm. Not my seeds! I wanted my seeds! He's just gonna keep going for knock off, so... Those are my seeds. There goes Swiss Dimensions back to normal. Ah. Ah. And here goes a trick room. <laughs> big pumpkin boy looking to clutch it up. Come on, pumpkin boy. Come on, pumpkin boy. Come on, pumpkin boy. You got this. You're gonna go for a star fall. Eat it up. Yo, say that's a tasty snack you got there. It's not a tasty snack. Oh, we do eat. We do eat. We're guys going for that overgrowth. We got KO here. We need that KO. I think it's calm minded. We do pick up the KO. Cool guys hits pretty hard. They're gonna change my terrain back. I want this one. Hey, now the thing is, we need somebody to miss. We need somebody to miss. We do need somebody to miss here. Give me some HP. Give me some HP. Oh, but dude, Urshfu is gonna. We need Urshfu to miss. That's a fact. We need Urshfu to miss. We need Urshifu to miss, cause he's gonna dump on me, man. <laughs> Not playing around. We gotta go for the overgrowth. We gotta overgrowth it. We need him to miss. Please. Have mercy. Have mercy! <laughs> First battle in the dump. We go 0 oh, 1. We gotta show off Pseudo Wudo actually dumping on Pokemon, but I feel like we play that one a little bit different. We potentially could have had that win. Maybe send Gorgas out before Pseudo Wudo to get the Dynamax and the follow me going. But we're starting off 0 1. We come to our second battle. Second battle coming at you guys. Looking for a win here. I'm just hoping we can get one win with this team in today's video. Considering it is so off meta and we're going up against teams like this. These guys got Colossal with that weakness policy steam engine. Alongside with Roboom, Moltres, Incineroar, and Urshfu. This just looks like it's going to be another tough battle. But I got to go in DD and or Beetle for sure to try to set up that, uh, that Trick Room. Uh, I really want to bring Pseudo Wudo because he rocks out up against that uh, Moltres and the Incineroar. And then in the final spot, I need something to take out that Rillaboom. And that's that's a big like that's a that's a tough thing right there. Is that Rillaboom? He's really really strong. Hopefully he doesn't bring it. He's definitely gonna bring it though. He's gotta bring it. I might bring Gorgas just for that, and just be able to Phantasm up on it. I don't like it. And that does do work up against that Dragapult as well. So I, I think that's I think that's a that's a dainty little that's a dainty little thing right there. But as much as I wanted Mudsdale, I think Gorgas is gonna come in here a little bit better. Because whatever Mudsdale can really uh. Do work on i feel like my what's called just does work on it as well my pseudo wudo we have that rock but i really do like that i really do like that make a move buddy but then ah, dude this is just gonna be tough man it's so tough playing up against the meta it's so tough it is so tough that's why i said i'm just looking for a win with this team i really am but hopefully you guys still do enjoy the content even though we might we might go on through this this video. We might go on through this video. Hopefully not. We're trying to get rolling with it, but I just wanted to show you guys a little bit different content because I know we've been using some meta teams recently. Besides that, I like the bike team. That was really, really good. So I'm trying to throw off uh, the meta with some uh, non-meta teams, but it's always tough to win with, the, with them. So he's going to go Colossal and Dragon Ball. Kind of saw that coming. That's why I'm going to just drop a follow on me here and set up a trick room. And set up a lovely little trick room. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. We're going to see these goggles come out and the weakness policy. That's pretty straightforward. Pretty normal set on these Pokemon. I mean, safety goggles are not norm normally on a Dragon Pole, but for a Dragon Pole like this, that's that's fair to have because he's just kind of sitting here on support. I think he has a Thunder Wave, the screens, and then maybe Surf. He has to have Surf on. Kind of saw that coming. But yeah, definitely follow me. Hey, yo, get over here, boy. And we're going to set up this trick room. We are going to set up this trick room. So to go home, man. Not dealing with you. Um, what other Pokemon do you have? Yeah, a lot of physical attacks, so I think Reflux is going to have to come out here first. He's probably going to dump on Indeedee, which is, I think it's totally fine. And in that case, I just bring out Pseudo Wudo, and he might be my Dynamax Pokemon for today's video. 
It's not bad. That's not bad. Not bad at all. Make a move, pup. Make a move. Yep, not a He's gonna drop a big old rock on me. A vocalist. Dude. Can't stand the meta sometimes. This is why I like playing casual battles. Like, if I'm trying to relax, I'll just play like, casual battles. But it's just like that same thing over and over again. You guys know it is. Which is, it just, it just gets annoying. Yeah, I would love to go up against teams like I'm using like this. Like, oh, I would love it. On a rank ladder, that'd be so much fun. Everybody using like different teams. Instead of everybody using the same team. But that's how most games go. I can't really complain. He's gonna surf. There goes that policy and the uh, steam engine. Well, good thing we are gonna alpha trick room. And I think it's speed boost it. Plus six. Plus six over here. This thing has three tailwinds on him. <laughs> there goes his policy. He's gonna vocalist, right? Yep. Into my indie, dubitably. Can indeed he eat up? Probably not. It does. That's lovely. Actually, no, it probably doesn't because he's gonna do 32 damage with the vocalist damage. Which I hate. Trick room comes out. Uh, I love how Orbital like flaps up its little ladybug wings up there. Come on, eat up, Indeedy. Yes. I love you. I love you, Indeedy. Okay, so we eat up. Uh, I am going to get off a reflect here. And do I just expanding force? Yeah, we're just going to expanding force. And we are just going to reflect. Hopefully, Indeedy is slower than that. Than that. Colossal? Thing is plus six. Thing is plus six. See what he does. See what you do. I'm not gonna go for bomb. I am not going to do that. Make a move. So indeed he will go down this time. Chances are what's called will go down here as well. Or beetle. But if I can get off a reflect and trick room and then have my two strong Pokemon come out, I think we should be looking pretty decent here. Let's see, what are you gonna do? It could be rocking uh ally switch. And that'd be cool if he shows it now, considering we're going for an expanding force. Make a move, pup. Make a move. Bandit Force does come out. Eat. Does some nice damage all around. I like that. I like that a lot. Here comes my Reflect. Big old Reflect coming out here. Now, the thing is, actually, I want my Orbital to, to survive here. Let's see what he goes for. He's going to go for a Light Screen. I should have went for a Follow Me. He's going to go after now. Oh, no. He's definitely going to go still go after Orbital. Have an Overgrowth. Okay. Proctor Seeds for me. I like that. Can we eat that? Can we eat that, buddy? Yeah, I was going to say, you should be able to eat that. Okay, you know what? I'm really, really liking that. Really liking that. To be honest with you, I could get out Gorgas right now. Indeed, he goes down. I still have an ally switch. But I need to take out my boy right here, right now. I need to take out, uh. I need to take out. Fossil. Fossil needs to go. It's a fact. Fact. So we do have a reflect up. In fact, Colossal does need to go. And that's why I want to bring out Pseudo Wudo. But at the same time, I want to bring out Gorg, guys. Hmm. I just go for a hammer arm. And try to look to pick up that KO? I don't think he's gonna. I don't think this Dragon Pulse Rock an ally switch. I really don't see that happening. So I think I'm gonna ally switch and drop a hammer arm. I think so. This will lower my speed, but I'm totally fine with that. I feel like we can potentially pick up KO here. But I am gonna ally switch. I'm gonna go for the hammer arm. See if this pays off. Let's see if this pays off. I really, really want to bring out my Gorgeist here, but I just don't see my Gorgeist picking out that Colossal. You get a defensive boost there too. Here comes my ally switch. Get that rolling. So hopefully he just takes out my Orbital here and I'll be fine with that. Hammer arm without the KO. Don't. Dude, we need that stab boost. We really did need that stab boost. But still, if you don't... If he doesn't uh, take out my pseudo voodoo here, that's still a, a good play. Will Wisp comes out. Yes. Yes. And go after that slot too. Go after that slot as well. Go after that slot. Go for a cliff on that. No, you're going on to my pseudo voodoo slot. Actually, you should be able to eat this up. Oh, no, he is. Beautiful. That is a great ally switch because now I bring in Gorgeist. I still have Trick Room. I bring in Gorgeist. I take out the Dragapult with my Dynamax Gorgeist. I get the defensive boost and I should be able to take out what's called No Problem. Uh, Colossal. Oh, yes. Jeans with the reeds. Jeans with the allies. Which, get out here, Gore guys. Get out here. And you set up the terrain for me, which I love. I love. Give me my defensive boost. We got defense boost. We got the reflect up. We have the trick room for, I think, three turns? Two turns, at least? I'm liking this. Give me them seeds, baby. Give me them seeds. All right. Okay. I can see a protect coming through. 
How many turns left in my trick? Let's check it out. Make sure. We have two. We have two. One more in the bulk with. Three more in the grace turn. We have a reflect probably for like the rest of the match. I'm gonna I'm gonna phantasm here. And I am as much as I want a head smash. Oh head smash super effective. Why didn't I didn't I could have KO'd this castle a year ago. <laughs> I could have KO'd him last turn. Wow, alright, never mind. That was stupid. That was stupid of me. Alright, we are gonna drop a nice little rock move here. He's gonna go real boom. That's fine. That's totally fine. We are gonna Dynamax. Wow, I, I could have KO'd the castle already. <laughs> I could have just dumped on him, but then he just lost all of his stats. So that's totally fine, and he's really low on HP. So I'm fine with that, that turn. Wow, dude, I could have slapped on it last year oh my lord I, I just figured I was like it's part rock type but it is part fire type and so I see it now but I was just like oh this thing's a big rock so should be dead here goes head smash oh my lord pseudo wudo my dude my dude doing some big damage over here phantasm gonna come out here definitely pick up the KO get out of my face we're gonna get a defensive drop as well it's pretty nice now who are you gonna bring out he doesn't have dynamax which I absolutely love which I absolutely love. We're bringing out the boys. Colossal should be dead. So if I lose this match because of Colossal coming back in here, I'm going to cry a little bit. But again, we have one more turn left in Trick Room. They're really nice. He is going to probably go for a... Uh... He is probably going to go... Oh, I do have Sucker Punch. I do have Sucker Punch. Oh, no. Something like that. Put a Sucker Punch on this roll, dude. Because I should... Because if he goes for a Grassy Guide, I should Sucker Punch. Sucker Punch should come out first because we are in the Trick Room, so that makes us the fastest. Or is he gonna fake me out? But I think I have to go. Hmm. Okay, now now it's looking a little tougher. It's looking a little tougher. Dude. I don't have protect on Sudo Widow. Who do I go after here? Yeah, I had the Phantasm. Oh my lord! I wish I'd protect. I wish I'd protect. Hmm. It's going to be a pain. This one is going to be a pain. I feel like I have to get this defensive drop. Go after Brill Boom. Is he going to fake me out? That's a real question. I feel like I have to go for a Sucker Punch anyway. Right, we're going to go over here. We're going to double up in this slot. Sucker Punch over on the Brill Boom. Hopefully he doesn't fake out. He's gonna go for oh Robin's gonna go for the fake out. Okay. Uh that's fine by me. I'll take you out. Okay. Okay, um I'm kinda fine, right? I don't see a flare blitz taking me out. He's gonna go for a part of the shot. Tudo Wudo is gonna be the big damage. Oh, he's gonna get off another intimidate? No way you go back. Ugh. Oh, that's ugly. That's real ugly. Wow, that Colossal should be dead, man. He's gonna bite me. He's gonna bite me so hard. The Trick Room is over. That is that is one thing. Trick Room is over. Trick Room is over. I feel like Colossal is super slow now. We are minus one because of the hammer arm. I can set off another Trick Room. I can if I want to. Thing. He's gonna get off another Intimidate, which is just, ugh, it's, it's annoying. It is very annoying. It's super annoying. Here's my Intimidate, or his Intimidate. Who's posing that bigger threat? I feel like Colossal. B? I still have another turn here. And I really want to get this defensive drop, so I'm gonna go after you. And I am going to go after you. The head smash. See what you do. Let's see what you do, kind sir. Poor guy should outspeed the colossal, right? I don't think he's gonna take it out though. I really don't think it's gonna take it out. I mean, I hope it takes it out, but I don't see it happening. I mean, I can go for a sucker punch that next turn. But I feel like this one's gonna be actually really, really close. He's gonna be able to fake me out again. Ooh, I hate you so much. Yeah, so I do outspeed. I do get a defensive drop, which is nice. Can I KO? Hate scheme, hate scheme. I do have sucker punch. I do have sucker punch. I do indeed have Sucker Punch. 
Pot's gonna go for Heat Wave. If he dodges it, Pseudo Wudo dodges it. Oh. What guys is able to eat? Go to defense. Okay, so I don't think I need to go for a Sucker Punch here. Only for the sheer fact that, uh, what's called does outspeed. What guys does outspeed. So I think I just Pseudo Wudo Rock. Do my little Rocky thing. Light Screen does wear off on them. The thing is, does Gore Guys. Does Gorgas eat up a Flare Blitz? I am defensive. Person. Could go for Shadow Sneak. I think Shadow Sneak's gonna do it for now. 40. E. Mm. He does not have an item, so I cannot do that. I think I have the Shadow Sneak. Though. I have the Shadow Sneak. I have the Head Smash. And the Shadow Sneak KO. I sure hope so. Plus, gonna protect. That's fine, my man. That sneak gets blocked. I need to be able to eat up this player boss. Eat it up. Eat it. Eat it, Gore guys. You are plus one. You are plus one on defense. Love you. Love you. You're my best friend. You're my best friend, Gore guys. Oh. Oh, now that's ugly. Now that's real ugly. <laughs> I hate this game. He gets a burn, too. Head smash coming in. Okay, um, oh my lord. Sudo Wudo. Sudo Wudo. You're the best. You're the best. He's the best. The one and only. The one and only. He gets a burn, we get a crit. Take that all day. And I actually just read something in the comment section down below that all my attack drops do not go towards that crit. That's why I did all that damage. Pseudo Wudo winning us this match? Yo, you love to see it, baby. You love to see it. We're gonna go for that head. So actually, I am gonna go for a sucker punch here. I want that for I want all that first turn priority. I want it all. I want it all. That was me coming out here. Get him out of here. This wouldn't have KO'd. We'll sucker punch do it. Second punch should be able to do it. Yes! Yes! Let's go, baby. Off meta team eating out here. We the best, baby. We can hop into our third battle and look to get a winning record with this pseudo wudo off meta team. Shout out to this guy over here, Raccoon. My boy, using some off meta Pokemon. Round of applause here. We're going to have ourselves a fun third and final battle. Looking for a winning record for, you guys already know, the Jeans Online Gaming. Community, baby. Looking for it for you guys. This guy is Zapdos AG Slash. Yo, I absolutely love that Pokemon. Haven't seen it in forever, so I'm glad he's getting some love in here. Got Sableye, he's got the Rillaboom, Silvalli, and King. My boy Gore Guys is definitely coming in here. Gore Guys looking like a stud here. Um, but I'm definitely gotta set up Trick Room here. He has a uh, no Trick Room using. I mean, the Sableye land Trick Room? Potentially. Gore Guys, you gotta come. I'm bringing Pseudo Wudo again. Um, I'm gonna leave. I don't wanna leave you. At the same time, kinda wanna go here. At the same time, kind of want to go here. Definitely bring a pseudo wudo and gore guys. I don't want to bring it's it's between these guys, these two as a lead. And since you have fake out, I'm gonna go in DD. It's the same squad. It is same squad. The first battle, did we go? Did we go the squad all all around? He might have. He might have went the squad all. I'm trying to remember. Or did we bring Mudsdale? He might have brought Mudsdale. The first battle. I, I I forget. I really do forget. I have, uh, they call me Dory sometimes. I have short-term memory loss. <laughs> I'm just playing around. I don't know why I'm forgetting. I usually, I actually have a really good memory. But, we're rocking out here. He's gonna go Zapdos and El Kingler. Santa Claus over here. Maybe it's G-Maxing. I'm gonna I'm trick him up. I'm gonna frisk it over here. I see the life orb, and I see this thing's rocking a berry. Alright, that's fair. Fair. We're gonna we pop in the stricken. We pop in the stricken. We can take out my NDD all day. Go for it. I feel like Kingler has like an ability that he just slaps up on me. Or no, that's Crawlon. Crawlon has adaptability, which is absolutely really good. I'm gonna get off this stricken and I am going to. Hey, say, hey, 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 over here, boys. You hit me. You ain't touching my bug friend. You're touching me. But dude, I'm, I'm stoked I got that win in that last battle. I'm stoked. You know, Pseudo Wudo clutching up, just hitting like an absolute truck. Center of attention, Heat Wave comes out here. Hey, yo, hey, hey! What are you doing? Better not have two double up moves here. Be kind of sad. Liquidation, that's fair. Dude, that's tasty snacky out there. Thank you. Oh my lord, Kingler. Kingler! That's fine. No, that's fine. Now, now, now you're bringing out the beast. Now you're bringing out beast. Now you're making me do this. Now he's making me do this. Now you are making me do this. I get it. I get you have liquidation. I get it. But what you don't know that I have, what you don't know that I have is ally switch. So I'm doing this. 
I'm saying, yo, see you later, Zapdos. I'm bringing out Gorgeist next turn after Orbital goes down. Oh, shoot. He protects. Dude, really protect. Actually, I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. As long as my pseudo would have not go down. We still have speed all day. This match comes out, block. Okay. Gorgeist can Dynamax next turn still. Liquidation comes out. Okay. No! No! Yo, dude, you did not! You did not! You did not! Yo, you did not! Yo, round of applause to this dude right here. He's gonna die. That's game, No. Yo, this dude did not. He did not just do that. He did not! He did, dude. He did. He did do that. Uh, you gotta go for that. I'm going for that. Oh! Oh my lord. I thought we were thriving. This is my plan. This is my whole plan. We had Trick Room set up. We have the speed advantage, all that. I head smash, Zapdos is gone. Easily. He goes into my Orbital. Orbital drops. That's fine. We saw Pseudo Wudo. Gore Guys. Gore Guys Dynamax takes out with an Overgrowth on the King. We're thriving there. And then we just roll out from there. No, man. And even if even that 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 just happened. If he took out Orbital, we take out King Oil like this. Head Smash comes in and takes out Zapdos. So we should have been thriving. We should have been thriving. Uh, is he going to go for a Heat Wave? Probably. Hopefully he misses my Ore Beetle. Hopefully he misses my Ore Beetle because I kind of need a secondary Pokemon here. My Seeds are popping. And I would love to get off this Reflect. Kingler goes down. And we are going to be able to get off this Reflect. Yeet. And what are you going to do? Don't you dare go for Heat Wave. Miss. He is going to go for Heat Wave. Beetle does not eat. Sad face. If I had Light me there, we were eating, but I, I was just reflecting. I want to reflect. Okay. Do I need to get rid of Zapdos? This needs to get. I might protect this one. What were you guys clutching this up? You guys owe me 6 billion subscribers on your 6 billion. Not million, billion. He's gonna pop out here. Oh, he's rocking, he's rocking the seeds too. He's rocking the seeds too. I see. In that case, I'm coming after you with this, Zapdos. Dropping your defense. Um, I wonder what he's going to rock out. He, I don't think neither of these Pokemon Dynamax. I really don't see that happening. But, yo, thank God. Uh, like, if I'm going to lose, at least I want to lose to an off man. I, I don't want to lose to a, a, just a straight, like, Larry Motion coming out here and just, oh, with Comfy. Blip, weakness policy prop. Blip, 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 game over. I don't want to lose that. Well, I want to lose something real like this. So, GG, this guy with an awesome protect. And King Lord doing some work. Able to eat that up. Uh, can Gore guys actually take out? He takes out here. That's huge. Wow. Wow. Wow! Dang game. That's where he waves. Wow, dude. Not a fan. Not a fan. He just go down to that damage. And the one thing is, I know my boy eats. Eats up a, uh, a grassy god. The thing is, this is what we have to do. This, this is how it's going to have to go down. We have to be able to KO the Sylvie. One shot here. And so it's not happening. We have to be able to do it. So we need a crit. Hopefully he doesn't Dynamax. Which he probably will. So we need a crit. And we need to eat up a Real Boom here. We need to eat up a Real Boom. Grassy Glide or whatever he has to offer. Because I think we can. I think he's only rocking Grass moves. He wouldn't have went for that. Or maybe he went for that because he thought we were going after, uh, what's it called? Maybe he thought we were going after the real boom. But we need to one-hit KO with this thing. Or we need, uh, uh yeah, that, that's, that's my, my best bet. We eat up the grassy guy, like I said. Now we come out here. And if we one-hit KO with this thing, we win. The chance starts, I have it. Let's do it. Give me the crit. No, even with the crit, we won't do it. That's whack. Okay, Hailstorm comes out and GG. GG. Alright, like I said, I was, I'm happy with just one win with this team. That feels like three. It feels like three with this team. But, yo, I'm actually glad the third and final battle was actually pretty decent. This guy brought an off meta team. He actually made the right calls. He was able to take out my, uh, my, uh, what's it called right off the rip. Uh, he, he was able to get my Pseudo Wudo out there, which, which really won him the game. If I had Pseudo Wudo, we won this game hands down. But we go one and two and we have a great video for today.
One last shout out to my boy Hayden for dropping this team. I absolutely loved it. You guys already know. I love off meta teams. They're so much fun to use and they're a blast on the rank ladder. But if you guys want to also drop me teams for me to potentially use on my YouTube channel, you guys already know the deal. Head in that link in the description below. Jeans underscore YouTube. There's a link down there. Just DM me over there. Send me the teams and I will get to your me guys' messages as soon as I can. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.